What's up everybody, Wolf here with another Pokemon Scarlet and Violet video. In today's video, I'm going to be trying my hand at playing with Pokemon Champion Gita's team. Um, <clears throat> I've taken the time to build all of her Pokemon from her team. Um, so, <laughs> this is what we have. We have Espathra, we have Alusa, King Gambit, Go-Goat, Avalug, and our famous Glamora. Um... The team is very physical heavy, uh, so the only special attackers we have are Espathra and Glamora. We do have hazard entries. We do have two different Pokemon who have ways of getting rid of hazard entries on our side. And um, we've kind of got a couple of Pokemon that if they get like a setup or two, can kind of just destroy their team. But a lot of these Pokemon are... Uh, like their their coverage is okay, or like they fall into that weird speed tier of where like they might outspeed some slow things, but outside that they're outsped by mostly everything else. But I mean, we'll see what happens. Um, I just want to see how good her team is, like you know, when a real player is playing with it instead of like the AI. So let's go ahead and jump over to some battles. Alright, let's see what our opponent picks, and we'll see how this is going to be for us. Okay, well, there's only two legendaries on their team. That's not so bad. Oh, boy, I'm so looking forward to this. Um... Oh, this is so crappy. I don't really have much that can handle a lot. <laughs> it's got freaking Arceus is over there. Right on. Oh boy, this is gonna be fun. See, Champion Gita is just no not her team just seems really lackluster compared to most other champions teams. Because a lot of her team shares a really bad weakness to just sharing a lot of the weaknesses. I mean, they're done, they're starting with Samurai. That's fine. We should be faster than him. Yeah, by like one if they're jolly. He just goes for the razor shell. I mean, yeah. Oh, I mean, now we got Tug Spikes and Stealth Rocks over there, so I mean, I guess that's that's good. I think I'm going to do Mortal Spin just to kind of get a Poison out there. Oh, he's got Sucker Punch. That's fair. No, I mean, okay, so now we have two layers. Alright, so let's think here. I think Go-Go's actually pretty decent coming to this one. I'm gonna do a bulk up. So so far we've seen Razor Shell and we've seen Sucker Punch. Right, so they're just gonna set up uh, rocks on me. I do have my Avalog to get rid of it. I guess we're just gonna go for a Horn Leech now. He could do another one to try and set up a, yeah, two layers. The crit! Why am I getting such bad luck against these teams? That's ridiculous. I wonder if they even realize, like, how lucky they're getting. I can't believe he just crit me. Nothing to me. Well, we got rid of that. That's so dumb, though. Just 
trying to get re healthy again. Oh my gosh. We're doing another rapid spin because he's just going to keep doing that. Eventually, Avalog will do enough rapid spins where he's just faster. <laughs> Are we faster yet? I don't think so. I would not imagine that we are faster yet. I just goes for another second sword. Okay, so there's no spikes now. I got a crit. Now I kind of just need to play like the stall game because, uh... We've got two layers of Toxic Spikes, we've got Stealth Rock, like our, we've got some pretty annoying stuff for his side to come in and deal with. Okay, so he's kind of just, you know, immune to it. I still did a heck of good damage. I use this for salt here. I wonder if he's got. Well, no, he. Does. How is he not affected by the toxic spikes? Because he doesn't have heavy duty boots on because he still took the stealth rock. So, I'm confused on that. Oh, I think it's his ability. Okay, he's just going for protects. I, kind of pro I probably could have recovered there. Luckily, we can still take a few more turns of Salt Cure because we're not water or steel. We can definitely take quite a few more of those. So I'm just going to keep doing this. They might try and go for another protect. Just trying to stall it out. Yep. This should KO. It doesn't? What? Okay, so he's definitely going to do protect again. Yeah, his ability doesn't allow him to be have status effects, that's, that's right. Alright, so I know you're going to do protect again. Because why wouldn't you? Yep. That's perfectly fine with me. Avalog is here to stay in the game. Alright, so I know he's got Protect, I know he's got Salt Cure. I imagine he's probably got, like, uh... Body Press and Iron Defense. Or he's got Recover and Iron Defense. It's gonna be one of those. Alright, so this thing's gone now. Avalog with two KOs right now. I did not need the crit for that one. But Avalog's got two KOs at the moment. This is too funny. Stupid salt cure. Alright, so now anything else coming in is going to have a problem to deal with the... Uh, spikes, or our toxic spikes and stealth rock now. Once well trained. There's the Moran. Yup. Yup. Sadly, I don't have a... Uh, I don't have an electric type. 
I don't really have anything to hit this thing with. And I don't really have anything I want to switch it into either. So we're probably just going to get rocked here, but we'll just go for it. Yeah, I imagine this just KOs us. We have, like, no special defense. Yeah. Alright, let's think here. I could bring in King Gambit. We have had quite a few allies go down. I don't think we could take a hit on that thing. Uh, we should be able to take a hit. We'll see, though. I'm just going to go for a quick sucker punch. We take those. This is still not going to feel good. Alright, but we still live with like half our HP. Alright, so we'll get another sucker punch in before we die. Alright, so I don't know what they're doing. Oh, they go for charge, so they'll just they'll just faint. Oh, that's another that's another that's a legendary down. We still have our CS to deal with. I just wish I had something to switch my, uh... Yep, there he is. I can't tell what typing it is. Um... You, you wouldn't go for a buff, would you? You shouldn't go for a buff. You don't. Eh, we get a little chip damage in there. Oh, you just go for Earthquake. Okay. That's fair. <laughs> That's totally fair. Oh, we're getting down to the nitty gritty. Um... Let's just do a combine. I don't know what move set it's running. Okay, it's just doing a new. So I get a free boost. That's really nice. Maybe Espathra can come through and finish collecting this up for us. Yeah, because the toxic will eventually be a little bit too much to deal with. So let's just go ahead and we'll do a substitute, maybe. Or we could do a Lumina Crash. Try and speed up the process. Oh, he's finally tearing. I wonder what Terry is going into. It is Terra Normal. That means we're probably about to be hit by the big boy move. Do we still out, do we outspeed though? Is my question. All right, he just extreme speed. This is not gonna feel good. Ow, that did a lot of damage. Okay, so it's life orb. So I think if he hits me with another extreme speed, um, the life orb plus the tick will probably KO it. I have to rely on my stupid fish to carry the rest of this match. That's ridiculous. And then Toxic should KO it. Yep. Oh boy, here we go. Valooza down to mercy. Two others. I can't believe how much work Avalog put in. That was crazy. 
Oh, I'm down to my last Pokemon. Here we go. I don't remember what he had left. Oh, I mean, this thing just straight up beats me. Yeah, this thing just, like, straight up beats me. Uh, I'm just gonna go for the Psycho Cut. I'm pretty sure he's got, like, Night Slash or something, but... It, just, it should just straight up beat me. Yeah, that's right, I'm gonna use my Terra finally. I mean, he outspeeds us. I'm just wondering if he one-shots us. Alright, so Shadow Sneak should not one-shot me. Doesn't even get me to half. This should do some sizable damage, too. Yeah, it just KOs. Oh my gosh, can Valooza, can Valooza pull this through for us? What's his last Pokemon? Oh, it's this thing. I think I just lose, don't I? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I just lose. I forgot he still had Meowth's Garner left. It just does Flower Trick. It. Oh, it's got Knock Off. Never mind. But yeah, that just straight up. Man, we were so close to winning that. Oh, we were so close. We managed to beat two legendaries. We took a crit to the face. Oh, so close. Well, guys, we can't win them all, but, like, that was a pretty good match for us, though. The team was slowly coming back. But, um, but yeah, so there's Champion Gita's team. It's, eh. It's it's mediocre compared to most other things, but uh, but yeah, that's Champion Gita's team. Avalog was surprisingly did really good for us in that match, and then um, I mean King Gamut got a kill, and then um, <laughs> Valusa just straight up one shotting the Iron Valiant was really nice. So I mean we got some KOs. It came down to the last Pokemon, so that makes me feel a little better, but. That's going to be it for this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!